Hey guys, Wayne here from H2 Tech Videos. Today I want to show you how to take a screenshot or a screen capture on Windows 10. Um, this also applies on Windows 8 and Windows 7, but the tutorial is on Windows 10, so we're going to focus it on 10. So um, there's a really cool thing built into Windows. It's called the snipping tool. A lot of people don't know about it. I just found out about it myself, actually. And it basically will allow you to take a screenshot or select certain parts of any screen that you're on. Um, and let me show you how it works. It's super cool. So I'm going to open up Internet Explorer. Or I um, forgot what you call the new one. Internet something. Guard. Whatever. Um, so we're open here. And let's say I want a screenshot this little page right here because I'm a Patriots fan my buddy's a Chiefs fan I want to gloat right so down here where it says ask me anything what we're gonna do is we're just gonna click we're gonna type in snipping s-n-i-p-p-i-n-g and this will come up snipping tool I didn't have to download this this comes built into Windows 10 we're gonna click on snipping tool and this cool little um, window comes up click on new and you'll notice the whole screen is gonna go like sort of a faded white and you're gonna take the mouse and you're gonna pick your starting place so I'm gonna pick here and on the mouse I'm gonna or on the trackpad you're gonna click a left click and hold it and drag it around the area that you want to select so let's say I want to get this whole section up until here I can do that and then it cuts just that section that I selected now what you can do you have a couple of options here I can go file and save as and then I can save it as like a PNG file or I can come down and save it as a JPEG but either way I'll have a copy of that picture and then I'm just gonna save it to the desktop so I'm just gonna type in Patriots win or Patriots win and then I'm gonna hit save okay but the other option this is the part I love you can just go to edit and copy and it's going to automatically make a copy of this for me and now I can open up for example uh, Microsoft Office or let's just say Microsoft Word or yeah Microsoft Word and I can actually paste this right into a Word document I'm going to create a new Word document just like that and on the keyboard, I'm going to hold Control and hit V to paste it. And there it is. I can paste it right into a Word document. Or I can even go right into uh, Gmail, for example. Um, I don't want to do that. I can go to Gmail. And sign... So really cool guys, um, again, it's called the snipping tool, it's so easy, it literally will allow you to again just uh, select a certain section of something and cut it, or the whole screen if you want to, and it's just that easy, um, yeah. If you want to screenshot the whole window, here's how you do it, so same thing, we're going to do our search, snipping tool click on it and I'm gonna go new and so if you wanted to basically select the entire screen you're gonna start all the way in the upper left corner click and drag it all the way across the whole screen so that would allow you to do a full screen capture of the whole screen but most of the time, people just want a certain section. So that's why that may not be totally ideal, but it's up to you. You select as much or as little as you want. And now it's going to be in the section where you can save it or you can copy it and paste it somewhere else. Last thing, you do have some, some tools up here where you can actually like highlight. You can you know do some drawing if you want to. Have all kind of fun with it. But um, that's how you select the entire screen. And I hope you guys found this helpful. Um, 
Make sure you like, favorite, share the video if it was helpful. Subscribe to HG Tech videos and um, take care. Have a good day.